I just want to give an overview of how redaction functions. So you come in here after you upload the video and you click the face button. And when you click the face button, all the objects show up on the right hand side and you can scroll through all the objects. And then you can make any additions or corrections as you watch the video and see how it did in redacting the videos. So as you can see here, I'm just going to watch various parts of this video. You can see here it's detecting all these faces here, so you don't have to do any of this manually. And even as you know the people come on and they move onto scene, for example. See following all these people as they're walking in. Let's skip to another part of the video, for example. You know, as they're walking through a hallway, you can see it's picking up all these people as the people walk on scene. All these people here in the scene. If you didn't have this automated, you would have to manually put a mark on everybody's person's face, go frame by frame, and simply select each, you know, follow each path. So, uh, you know, we're saving a lot of time by doing not having to do that. So, uh, to give you an overview, you know, any corrections, you, you can make a lot of any corrections or additions you want to this. So, um, you can see here, overview of it. Um, if you want to just make the mask a little wider, all you do is, you know, move the arrows up and down on the appropriate mask. Or if there's a fa false positive and there's a couple of small false positives, you know, all you have to do is click the trash can and, you know, the tra delete the track and the track will be gone. Uh, so, uh, you know, that's a, a brief overview of the main functionality of Redaction. You can see, you know, it's doing a good job detecting all the faces, even as you're moving throughout scene, as the people are moving around. So, uh, you know, it saves all this time. You know, it doesn't matter if the people are far away or close to the camera. It does a good job of picking them up. Um, for example, uh, you can see this scene here, for example. So there's all these people here, for example. And uh, thankfully, you know, it's catching all these faces on all this frame, so you can just sit here and, and, and not have to go frame by frame on this process. Here I'm key stepping using my DNF key, just going frame by frame. You can see you can easily just, uh, you know, make any, follow it, uh, watch it, make any additions, corrections, simply. To mute audio, I want to show this brief briefly. All you do is drag and drop onto this bar here, and it'll mute the audio. So if you're playing the audio, for example, And see here where the red lines up with this bar. Now there's no media, there's no audio. So that's an overview of how Redaction works. To f to finish the Redaction, just click the Save button, and the video will start generating generating the final video. You give you progress at all times up here, how long it takes, and then it, you know it should finish fairly quickly. And then uh, you know then you're done with re Redacting the video, and you can download the video.